Hey so guys, it's your boy Uncle Bobby here today, and we're gonna be building this like Honda Beat looking thing, the small version, and we're just gonna throw a V8 inside of it, hopefully in the back, um, make this a complete fucking death trap. So it's gonna be carbon fiber, actually uh, aluminum panels, um, semi space frame, mid longitudinal, double wishbone, and push rod in the back. Maybe. Actually, fuck it. McPherson in the back. Just so. Actually. Double wishbone in the back. Okay. Now we have enough room to make the engine. So, what we're gonna do, we're gonna throw a 90 degree V8 in here. Actually, no. 60 degree V8. It's gonna be rear wheel drive. This, this, this V8 has to be really small. 800 cc yes aluminum dual overhead cam five valves per cylinder aluminum just so it's like pretty like not heavy i forgot the word for not heavy light there we go light vvt sure turbo yes fuck it performance turbo i guess i don't know injection direct injection per cylinder standard actually performance and premium gas. The fucking intercooler is bigger than the engine. Look at the little turbo! <gasps> Look at the little turbo! Oh my oh my god, that turbo is so small. Look at this! It's like big suck, little suck. <laughs> and then look <laughs> What the fuck is this? Why is that so funny to me? Okay, dual exhaust, high flow free uh, uh, it's straight through 70 horsepower. Whoa. Turbine? Yeah, should we, we should take some of that. How much RPM can we get? Oh, 1100 RPM? How about we make that even more? We just do that. We can get like a million RPM in this. Oh, yes. 12,000 RPM, rev it into nothing. There's a little negative. Negative four horsepower, dude. What the hell? Okay, now we just gotta make this shit better. What's our problem? The compressor. Make that bitch bigger than. Oh my god, the. We can rev it up to like 70, 100, I guess. But we can rev it up to 1200 or 12,000 just to be like, yeah, we can rev to 12,000. Can you rev to 12,000? 12, no, you can't. Because you a bitch. That's why. Okay, let's, let's, oh, here we go. Here's fixing our problem. Yeah, bring that up. Bring that up. Yes. Yes. We got turbine problems. Bigger, please. Boost. Add boost. You're fucking all the boost. I don't. I don't care that the compressor's about to explode. Make that bitch bigger than. 140 horsepower, okay. Compression? Are we fucking up on the comp- Nope. Again, oh, there we go. There we go. 142 horsepower, that's pretty good. We can use a little bit more of our gas, yeah? That's enough. Ignition timing. Whatever, we're good. Let's listen to this engine. Okay, that sounds weird. Okay, so it's it going it's going to the, the it's going in there somehow. So yeah, let's just do have like this body style because I kind of like like the weird hatchback going on here. So yeah, let's use that. And I'm just gonna build this on camera because I don't feel like making a time lapse today. Um, this has to be a really weird color. Th that's about uh, excuse me. That's about right. That's a pretty weird color. And then the wheel has to be like black. Yes. 
And then everything else has to be like black. The roof, black. Well, that kind of looks sick. I kind of vibe with that. Can't, how do you, how do people are make, wait, how do people are making, how are people making windows? There we go. I can use my brain. All right, uh, design the front of this. Um, double vent grill like this well like up and tilted a little tiny bit but connected a little bit there we go I didn't put a little bit of a vent on the side of them yeah that's how you do it Boom. That looks horrible. I, I hate it. How do you design modern cars? I can't do that. Do we... Is, it, is there like a cheat code? To design modern cars? This? Boom. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's horrible. I hate it. No, we're not using that. Uh... I don't know what all that is. I finally got my mods working. I'm overwhelmed. Oh, here we go. There we go. Those aren't completely horrible. Now we gotta put a grill on this thing. Happy grill! and stretch it out. Boom! Happy car! And then you just gotta add like the, the second uh, grill thing. My fucking AC turned on, one second. Hey! What did I tell you about turning on when I recorded? I am back. Just had to deal with that. I think we can use this like preset thing. Maybe it will work. Ah? Yeah, that low key works. Now we just gotta find the logo that we're gonna use for tungsten. Cause I keep forgetting what like brand logos I even use. Uh, oh, this is all like, I don't know what that is. Autobello from Beam. That T, I need a T here, this is close enough. Can't even see it, Never mind. Oh, what the hell is going on here? Fix that. We have issues, but I'm just gonna ignore them. Now I need to put wheels on this. These ones. No. Eh. These ones. No, these ones. Yes. These ones. Yes. Are these exhausts? Like, what? Okay, uh, door handle. Just, just rip them off of Civic. Slap them on there. Indicator. Sure. Indicator? I barely know her. We're just ripping parts off of all their cars, it looks like. And then I'm just going to do my thing. Ooh, R8. Uh, I mean, uh, NSX headlights. Taillights. Those look horrible on there. Hey, these are NSX taillights. Huh? What's going on here? Hmm... And we do one big tail light. Because that's always really fucking cool. Does it look good on this car? Oh, it can. Wow. That looks pretty good. Wow, I, I spit everywhere. Oh, God. Just kind of slap that down here. I don't want chrome. Nobody likes chrome anymore. Slap those down there. We got that sticking out, so I don't really know how to fix that. I mean, maybe we could go back here and... Did all my shit disappear? I swear to God.
All my shit really disappeared. Oh no, we're, we're, we're chilling. I can just make those into exhausts, I guess. Or we can just kind of... There. Yes. See, I smart. I very smart. Hope you guys like this kind of like a lot. Oh, I thought the car was driving away for a second. That was trippy. Reset the camera, please. How do I do that? I don't know how to reset the camera. Help. Uh, it's, it's connected to this one spot. Reset camera. There we go. And, you know, we can just... just who says we can't have big exhausts on a 800cc V8 car? Not me. Let's put a little bit of a scoop. Ooh. Oh. What? When did... The fuck? There's a whole engine! Wait... Oh my god! That's a... Is that a supercharger? What the... Okay. Well, I... I... Who downloaded my mods? For the longest time, no mods were working, and then all of a sudden, just the most random mods just diarrhea themselves all over the place. But yeah, I was put a little bit of scoop there to cool. I was gonna, what I was doing was putting on a Japanese plate, but uh, there. There's our car. Next, we don't need mirrors. Rear wheel drive, and we can do all wheel drive, and rear wheel drive. Manual, six speed, 162 mile an hour top speed. This thing's a death trap. Uh, electric limit slip differential. Blah. Sports compound tires. Cause this is sports car, mom. It's a Japanese imported right hand drive sports car, mom. I bought it from righthanddrivespecialties.com, mom. Okay, Timmy, how much was the car? Oh, it was only $5,000 plus the import fee, mom. Really, you, you, you spent that much money for a fucking K car. I'm not, I'm, I'm, I'm joking, I'm joking. I, I would fucking love like a Sarah or something, Toyota Sarah. Or an AutoZam. Them bitches are cool. Tinted disc, tinted disc. I do think AutoZams are pretty sick. Oh, we gotta make the wheels not look like ass. There we go. Less ass. No under tray. Two seats. Standard interior. Some of that. Standard 90s, because look at this shit. You think that's going to be safe? Well, you're wrong. Oh, active sports springs. Uh, excuse me. What do you mean nobody likes the car? 25 miles to the gallon. What do you mean? How much does it weigh? Oh, it's expensive as fuck. Yo! It weighs less than 2,000 pounds! <laughs> Bruh! It weighs less than 2,000 pounds! Bro, this thing is a death trap. Wow. Wait! How much does it weigh? Bruh! It literally weighs less than my fucking motorcycle! Okay, see you guys in beam. Okay, so here's our death trap in the steel- No, I was about to say in the flesh, but it's made out of aluminum, so I guess in the aluminum. Um... I kinda dig it. Like, actually, I kinda really like it. it looks pretty sick, I would own one of these. If it wouldn't kill me, so let's see if it would kill me. Spin. We're going to 80, which is way too fast in a car this small. Actually, this car isn't even that small. We're 
still going. One thirty, two, three, four, six. Okay, so 140 is basically the top speed in like a smaller distance. More than like Okay, racetrack time. I haven't seen how like it handles yet. So we're just gonna see. I don't even care. Um Yeah, hey, if you guys made it this far, comment down below and be like, yeah man, I'm a real fan, I made it this far. The sound coming from this car does not make any sense. It's really confusing me. Alright. Let's turn off the stability control. Let's get it. Oh, well, the brakes are really good. I wasn't expecting that. Since all the brakes in all my cars are ass. What the fuck? It handles really good, too. We're drifting though. It's kind of tail happy. A little bit twitchy. Maybe kind of like an MR2. Because like the engine's in the back, you know. And it's after firing all over the damn place. I, I braked way too late. Or early. Braked way too early. If you floor it, it won't spin. Famous last words. Alright. Oh, I missed the fucking track. I was too busy looking at the car and I missed the track. Okay, you can be done crashing now. Um, until next time, it's your boy Uncle Babu. I'll see you guys later.